Hey, what's going on everyone? Is now the time to bet big in AMC stock? I'm trying to break this down for you in a real simple way uh, to try to understand what the market is up to, what they're preparing themselves for. Because over the last couple of trading days in AMC, you guys can see that this market really hasn't traded. And it looks like the market is bumping its head against like $6 or maybe $5.50. Is it ready for a breakout? Because this is another thing I wanted to point out. Let's clean this up first. Okay, now this is cleaner and you can see how the market in AMC, the lows has been getting higher and higher. What does that mean? What does it mean in terms of supply and demand? It means that the buyers immediately come in when price dips down, they come in and buy. But the only problem that I'm seeing into the market in AMC that is really hindering this stock's from breaking out. This stock from breaking out is this sell zone right around here. Okay, it's right here. This is the problem. Because when AMC comes to $6, the selling increase, the demand leaves, and price goes back down. It looks like AMC is waiting for this earnings tomorrow as to whether or not it's going to break out or continue to trend down. Looking at this on the three day chart, this doesn't happen if the market doesn't want to break out, right? You won't see a bar close down on the low, right? And then the next three days goes back up, right? It shows you a lot of contention, shows you a lot of people battling it out between whether or not they're buyers and or sellers because the market wants to go up. It, it really wants to go up. But when it does, these sellers hit the market again and bring the stock back down. That's the current situation that we're seeing into the market in AMC. Here's AMC on the four day chart. Okay, so this looks like a pretty good area to see a buy zone. So we got the sellers, we know where the sellers are. This is where the buyers are. Okay, so let me show you on the daily. And we can create this area as a buy zone too. Okay. So now. Here is AMC on the seven hour chart. You can see these price bars right here, I tell you. You can see market breaks up. Immediately we see the market close either towards the low of the bar or off of the highs. Every time we look at this. So again, it makes you wonder who is up here at this $6 level, $5.50 level that continues to hit the market and push price back down because they got a whole guap of stock that they're selling and that they're releasing every time price wants to move towards $6. Okay. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to anticipate though that the market wants to continue to go up. Okay, so what I'm going to do, albeit I just want you to know what this market is up against because these sellers around five fifty six dollars is definitely determined to try to keep this market down. And I know many of you may say, well, that might be Ken Griffin or Citadel or another particular institution that's trying to short this stock. So this is our targets though. Uh, our first target is going to be right here at this first sell zone because we're not going to be crazy. We know that this is a problem. It's around 12 and a quarter percent at the high of that sell zone. It may just hit this lower end sell zone. Like I get it. It might just bounce here. That gives us 9% on the low. At the high, it gives us around like 12 and a quarter. Then the next target is going to be at the high of this particular day. 
May 15, 2024. We'll try to target that high. So we'll see what happens in AMC, especially at the earnings. All right, so go ahead and give me your thoughts. Uh, make sure you maintain the profitability. And as always, trade different. Before you go, make sure you hit the like button. You know, share the video and also subscribe. You guys want to have a heads up as to where prices are going to go in a simplistic manner.